Welcome to the Pacific Northwest. The Buckeyes have one of the best freshmen in all of college basketball. They sure do, and D'Angelo Russell is a do-everything guy for the Ohio State Buckeyes, but he's been quoted as saying his favorite thing is passing the ball, and he has had some spectacular ones. He sort of ranks them as, you know, to, up to his all-time favorites. This may be his favorite right there, the bounce pass <laughs> through traffic. This is a guy, he's a big risk taker, so risk-reward type of thing, and yep, take a bow when you make a pass like that. Russell so far has not shot, and he has turned it over once, and he's got the ball right now with six minutes gone. A little crossover on Johnson to the rack, and that is what he can do so well. He's got the size of a tight end. Burgess, reverse, Cox. Knocked away by Russell. Another offensive rebound. And, and Russell knocks it away again. Back to back that? blocks Woo. here by the freshman D'Angelo Russell. Elvin Johnson with the runner, but there's a lot of size inside from the Bucks. And here comes Scott on the side. Russell free. McDonald is screen. Scott with the mismatch on Ellie Cox. Russell, triple, book it! That's a one time VCU led by 12. The talented freshman from outside, Russell, right there. How about this back to back baskets by D'Angelo Russell? Let's see if that Mata may have used something oh, up for the Great pass! Freshman. And huh? I guess he did. Two to play in the first half. Lewis, long reach, knocked away by Russell. 14 5 run. Well, 11 of 26 from the field, three of nine from the free throw line, and you're only down one possession. To come within one, he got it on the runner, Russell. You know, both you guys like Russell. Let's take a look at what he did in the first half. He was terrific toward the end. Wow, for about the first 10 minutes, he really wasn't, didn't look like he was out there, but he blocked a couple of shots. He knocked down a couple of threes. He scored a layup going to the basket. He just sort of orchestrated everything out there. Off the bench, his first two. Yeah. Does have some size inside. The try by Scott. Williams, three. And Corral by Russell. He's got his second rebound. Ahead it goes. Scott will slash and feed Russell. He'll take a three for the lead. Got it! This young man is Woo! so smooth with the basketball. And Graham out there for the Rams and inbounding Jordan Burgess. That is the VCU five. Oh, what a great lunge right there by Russell, who keeps it for Ohio State. But the defense right there for the Rams. Scott across the lane. Russell off balance. Oh, and he nails the shot from outside. I would have looked at you crazy. Here's the steal by Plastic Man, D'Angelo Russell. He just tips the ball and then out hustles guests to go get it. I'm amazed that ball stayed in balance. And then again, he's not really very well on balance and knocked it down. <laughs> oh, I like it. Fan yourself down, young no, no, man. No, no, no. And when VCU scores, that allows them to set this pressure, and it was the pressure that caused Ohio State to speed up in the first half. Russell in stride. Loving will glide. Get it. Send him to the stripe. So with the ball, Scott. Out there with Thompson and Russell and Tate. They go, what a pass, what a pass inside. Russell caught it. Johnson, Williams, here's Brooks defending the driving Russell. Scott is on top. We're approaching seven to play. Russell will slash the burst inside, the lost ball, and then he puts it up and in. Brooks, Russell to defend. Oh, how about the nice defensive effort by Russell not giving up on the play? Brooks was more worried about Russell and oh, maybe trying to draw a foul. Russell has got a cut over his left eye or next to his left oh, eye. Oh, my. And he is going to have to have that sewn up. Let's send it over to Rachel. Well, guys, it looks like, in fact, they have gotten the bleeding stopped on D'Angelo Russell. The question now is how quick can they cover him up and get him back out there? I would like to say that as D'Angelo Russell is trying to stop a gusher on his forehead, holding a towel to his face, talking to the medical staff, he was also yelling at his teammates' instructions to keep pressing and win this game without him if need be. But they are trying as hard as they can to get him back on the court. I got to go with my best lineup. I bring back Jay Sean Tate in that smaller lineup so you can go man to man and switch everything. Russell. And oh, no! good oh, shot. The made is they can switch the screen. Brooks a three and picked up inside by Russell. 
cramp. Started here in overtime. Oh, you got to put that in. Just grinding his way. Russell. Sam Thompson to the trail and Russell. This is for the tie from Graham. Rebound inside by Bates Diop. Now that kid should just hang on to the ball. Russell from the free throw line, only two of five on the day. Stanley Johnson, D'Angelo Russell. Got it. And I don't know that it separates him from this guy. This guy can do everything on the basketball court. Drive to the basket, yeah, he's got that. In transition, absolutely he can do that. You want somebody to step out and shoot a three? Okay, he'll do that and then move him without the basketball, laying it in, he's your man. Well, in my opinion, that's because they're going against one of the best defensive teams in the country in Arizona because of that size you mentioned. And that between Louisville and OSU, he just clicked with Thad Mata. He told me Thad Mata was just more his kind of guy than Rick Pitino. The Big Ten Freshman of the Year finding the cutting Thompson. How about the court vision? And they find the twirling Stanley Johnson, which is knocked away inside by Thompson. Thompson and has a great start here, Kevin. They go inside, and Thompson with a slashing move and a foul. He's been a really important cog for Arizona here early. He doesn't normally score that many points this early in the game, but he's needed them today. Oh, McDonald lays the woods in game one later this afternoon. And tonight for you on the East Coast, it'll be Georgetown and Utah. Wrestle the drive. That's way too easy. It is the sixth turnover you for can, Arizona and you can but I agree with you there have been some that have been completely unforced got to be a little bit more careful with the ball what oh, yeah. inside to Williams what a pass and Tate had it knocked away well here's Russell coming off the screen of Amir Williams again and they've had a lot of success on the base line <laughs> Ashley missing at the shot clock buzzer Williams with another rebound he's got two down court Tate how about the pass there by yeah, D'Angelo yeah. Russell well, when you run the floor for this Ohio State. Look at the no look. He's over here looking at Dan Bonner as he's throwing the ball to Tate. I mean, this kid is special here. Mm. We said D'Angelo Russell is a do everything kind of guy. Well, he's done it with his passing today. Nice little drop pass for a dunk to Sam Thompson. Just drops it for Amir Williams to another dunk. How about this? Through traffic in transition. Russell comes out of the pack. Ahead he goes. Scott on the move. McConnell in his way. And he trains the deuce. When Stanley Johnson and Hollis Jefferson can be a little bit more effective in driving the basketball. Arizona has their biggest lead here today with Russell outside Thompson three. Oh, nice answer. Got to be careful with the basketball around McConnell. Such good, strong hands. Russell. Oh. McConnell the steal and a pass intended for Russell. McConnell hits, knocked away by Russell. People wanted to be a big scorer, but Rondé said it was last year that he decided this was going to be his specialty. The other guys, when we talked to them yesterday... And they have not looked back, and McConnell has been the catalyst the entire afternoon. How about Arizona? 20 of 24 from the strike. Plus eight points from the line. Thompson gets it to go. And Arizona, the two-seed in the West, is going to the Sweet 16.